Okay, thank you. I've neat. I've neat. Um, what's going to be the name? Your pen. After just six weeks teaching, like many new teachers, NQT Amy Mays is exhausted. Right, orange. Okay, this is what you have to do for your film. I'm almost there. Come on. I remember the first couple of weeks in September, I thought, what's all this tiredness about? I really wasn't that really tired. And then it was like the third week, it was like a wall that just kind of hit me and I was just shattered. Number one, can you go out on the week at all? Can I, if, I'm, if you're giving me advice and I'm saying I'm about to go and do my first six weeks teaching, uh, am I allowed to go out? I would say go out, you have to, because otherwise you're going to go insane, but it is so difficult. You know, you've got 24, 25, 14 year olds staring at you, ready to do a lesson. You've got an hour and a half to fill. Okay, don't turn it over, don't turn them over. I'm going to put paper on your desk, do not turn it over. <laughs> Don't turn it over, I didn't ask you to turn it over. Just tell me what you think you're hearing and seeing there. Okay, anything else? I'm moving around an awful lot. Yeah. And there's a lot of kind of chatter. Yeah. Um, and I'm talking an awful lot. Yeah. And it's just my voice, it's just, you know. Rrr, rrr, rrr. Yes, charming though it is. If you could now turn over your paper, there should be one each. OK, there should be one each. Yeah. OK, year 10, that wasn't... That wasn't an indication to talk, OK? You just had to turn over a piece of paper. It's not hard. Suppose you had laryngitis. Suppose I told you you're going to have laryngitis for a fortnight. Oh, it'd be marvellous. Mm. It can be arranged. <laughs> uh, if you got laryngitis for a fortnight, what, what things might you do to ensure that the learning went on? A lot of sheets with the instructions on, a lot of visual images, and I would get the students to read up the instructions. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! <-wa>. OK. <laughs> Obviously, the direction I'm going in is that I think you're doing too much work in the classroom. Idea number one is children want to talk and we want and we want them to talk. Yeah. I think we know that children learn better when they're able to reflect on and discuss their own ideas. And I think that probably means if we take that idea seriously, that children should be talking about 70% of the time in a lesson. So one is we tell them uh, we, that we want them to talk. Second is we tell them how we want them to talk. And then the third thing is we're really explicit in how we give those instructions. Right, Aramis, can your group go next, please? Aww. Come on, Chelsea. At the end of the lesson, another typically exhausting problem emerges, persuading reluctant students to listen to each other's final presentation. Okay. Right, you're ten. You're ten. I'm waiting, we're going to run out of time. OK, and I want to get these done by the end of the lesson. Shh, boys. One, I'm getting a bit fed up. Had enough? Yeah. OK, now what's going on here? It's quite interesting, isn't it? They don't want to listen, so I'm getting fed up because I want to listen to them. And it's kind of that disrespect that they have for each other. This is when I get really tired. It's seventh period, it's the end of seventh period. I've had a full day. I'm knackered. Just be quiet. You just told me I'm at the end of a lesson. They want to listen to themselves. They don't want to listen to each other. I'd like you to be him just for a minute. You're going to do a presentation and then six other groups are going to do their presentation. Tell me what it's going to be like for you. I'm going to be quite bored. Are you? <laughs> yeah. But aren't the, others, aren't the other presentations superly interesting? Yeah, but once I've done mine, you know, what else am I looking for? Why else am I watching it? Why am I watching theirs? Mm. I know what I should have done. Go on. I should have given them like a worksheet that they can review each other's or perhaps, you know, what went well, even better if for each group. It's something like that, isn't it? Yeah. I, 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 so they've I mean, got something to focus on during the presentation? Yeah. What have we learned about fatigue and teaching? Um. What have I learnt? That it's easily manageable and what I've got to do is instead of doing all the work myself, I've got to make them work for me. I even wonder if it's something that you couldn't say to the class, which is that from now on, whenever I come to an important activity, I'm going to ask you if I should be doing this or you should be doing it. <laughs>